The Nigeria Institute of Building has called for standards and best practice to be put in place when constructing to avoid building collapse in Lagos State. The Institute made this known as it prepares to host stakeholders in the build industry for a conference with the theme, The Shifting Landscape. Practitioners believe all hands must be on deck to urgently reduce the spate of building collapse in the state. They called on Nigerians uh, to be at the vanguard for safe buildings. There is also need for us to ensure standards and best practice in how people put these buildings together. And what we believe is that by collaborating with the government, which we have been doing from time to time through our advocacy, through engagement, that building collapse can actually be reduced minimally. The building will continue to collapse if uh, the government, the professional, the developer are not doing what they need to do. Now, there's this case of, uh, is the government really doing their state certification as they should? Is the government really doing the state certification as they should? Is the professional doing what they ought to do? Is the client also doing what they ought to do? Now, if you have to add everything together, we need to look at the culture itself. Things are not done properly, and now we are pushing it to the government and the public. If you see something, you say something. That will save life. That will save property. And then that will even enhance the productivity of the government and its agency in giving service back to the people. In Nigerian Institute of Building, we are not sleeping. We are not resting on our, on our house. The menace of building collapse. That's why when you talk about Lagos now, you talk about building collapse. We need to shift from that position. We are not killers. We are professionals and we are trained and we are backed by Act Cap 13 of the law of the Federal Republic of Nigeria for building production and its management.